Hello, dear friends, and welcome to Season 5 of College Cooking. This is pretty exciting. I hope you guys had a good summer. Uh, to start things off, we're going to start with a breakfast, because breakfast is one of the three most important meals of the day. That's what I always say. And uh, it's going to be, I'm going to call it the Breakfast of Champions. It's based off something I had at George Webb's this summer. If you haven't been to George Webb's, it's pretty tasty. <laughs> We have some sausage with miel and ale. We have an onion, a green pepper, some Kraft single cheese, some hash browns, some hash browns rizzolis. Now, I prefer shredded hash browns, but you can see these aren't shredded. I couldn't find any shredded hash browns. And here are some eggs. So uh, let's get started. The first thing we want to do is prepare a pan, and we're going to do this by putting it on low heat and then putting a dollop of butter. Now, I left my tripod back in Wisconsin, so we're gonna try and uh, try and do this with one hand. Well, there is our dollop of butter. We'll let it melt. Next, we're going to take our snossage, and we are going to unwrap it. Pretty skilled with one hand. And we are going to, whoa there, whoa there. Okay, I think I was filming the floor for a second. Um, we're going to, Peel the skin off, and then we are going to cut it up into little pieces. Now it's a simple matter of cutting these up into little slices. Okay, and let's go check on the pan. So it's melting pretty good, so I'm going to turn up the heat a bit to four. And then we will uh, put the sausage in the butter. Now we have a half of the onion, and we are going to uh, slice it up into small pieces and put that in with the sausage. Give this a uh, couple seconds more, and then we will put the onions in. Onions! All right, so there, I've green peppered it up, and then I will add those to the onions and things. Uh, we'll crack three eggs into this container. They're small eggs, otherwise I'd just do two. Oh, one-handed. Do I get a raise for that? <laughs> Got a shell in it. It's a lot harder with one hand, I'll tell you that. Oh man, there's a lot of shell in there. Okay, BRB. Alright, now we're gonna beat these eggs Chris Brown style. And then we'll add a dash of milk. Splash. Alrighty, so I doubled it up. It's now six small eggs. And I guess I'll just pour that on top of the, the sausage and things. And we'll let that scramble. So at this point, the scrambled egg portion is pretty much done, and I'd like to point out that I didn't quite get the ratios right. Uh, I have way too much green pepper, I ended up adding the whole pepper, and I have way too much sausage. Um, it should, the consistency see, as it is at George Webb's, is mostly scrambled eggs with these things sprinkled in, but this it looks like these things with eggs sprinkled in. So, whatever. So in a side pan, I've added a dollop of oil, in this case sunflower oil. And we're going to let that heat up and then add the hash browns. I just added the hash browns to the pan and I noticed something funny because if you look right there in the center of the screen, that is a french fry in with the hash browns. <laughs> Let me tell you guys quickly the trick for making good hash browns. The first thing you want to do is add a dollop of oil to the pan as I did at the beginning. And you want to put it on high heat, so like 9 or 10 or whatever. And you let the oil heat up fully before you put the hash browns in. Then you put the hash browns in, you let it cook for about three minutes, and then you flip it, and then you do three minutes until all the sides are as crispy as you want them. That's, uh, that's the best way, I think. All right, so now we're gonna make a base layer of the hash to the browns. Then we're gonna melt some cheese on top of those. We're going to take our super mixture here. And we, oh, wow, that's, uh, We'll cut the cheese, and then we will place that on top, like so. And uh, 
Now there's just one more thing we need and we'll be ready for the breakfast of champions. Final ingredient, a big old glass of chocolate milk. And there we have it, the breakfast of champions. So now usually what I'd do here is I'd set up the tripod and then give it a taste. But seeing as, again, we don't have the tripod, we'll, uh, we'll have to do it. We'll have to improvise. Okay. We're going to want to bite with everything in it. So there we go. Some, you can't see what I'm doing. I, I, my camera keeps wiggling. Okay. Okay. Give me a second. Hey, this is pretty tasty. The the sausage isn't the right kind. It tastes really goofy in it. But everything else is uh pretty darn good. Cheers. Anyway, that's all I've got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you have a fantastic week and I will see you next week.